All right, guys, it is uh, Friday the 19th today. Oh, yeah, Ricky. Rick, come here. Show him. Fade it up. Show him. Sheesh. See it. <laughs> How you like it, huh? <laughs> we were going to play two today, but uh, the field was literally a swamp. I'll put the picture up right now. The field was literally a swamp. We could not play two today because the rain was so bad yesterday, it got canceled. So we're gonna play one at seven tonight. It's around 12 o'clock right now. So we got here at 10.45 for what was supposed to be a double header, but now it is only a single game at seven. So most of the guys are going home. I'm gonna stay and get my throwing in and then might head home, might stay here, not sure. But yeah, one game tonight, seven o'clock, two seven innings tomorrow, starting at two, I think. So it's already been a mess of a weekend and we haven't even played a game. So stumped, anything? Boys got about seven hours to get Get prepared, get jacked. Seven hours, yeah, I know. It's Cox. 12 o'clock. So yesterday I went to Dick's. Can they see the shorts? Yeah. Alright, that's all that matters. Yesterday we went to Dick's, got a new pair of shorts. Dick's Sporting Goods brand, best brand there is. That's all I got to say. I'll see you later this evening. We've been doing two sets of 25 now, so I basically throw 25, take a little break, 25 more. It's a workload, but arm's been feeling good. Staying in the constraints of the velo, I'm supposed to be throwing 59 to 64. This pitch logic has been helping me out. Shout out to pitch logic. So, yeah, gonna get into the second set here. Yeah, let's get it. Arm felt pretty good today. Can't complain about how my arm's been feeling. It's been feeling great every day, but I also obviously have not been throwing extremely hard. I have to keep it within the constraints of the velocity, as I said earlier, but I'm just learning a lot of new things throughout this process. Thing number one that I've learned is I struggle to throw the ball slowly. It's hard for me to play catch at a slower speed. And I've kind of always known this, but staying within these constraints is difficult to try and throw the ball where I want to throw it right now because I'm not throwing the ball hard. When you throw slower and you're trying to throw slower, your body gets out of sync a little bit because you're trying to aim the ball, which obviously you're not supposed to do, but it's difficult at this stage because, I, like I said, I haven't really thrown slow like this um, ever. So it's definitely something interesting, but I'm basically trying to throw the ball to his chest every time. And it's, it's difficult to do that because obviously I haven't thrown in a long time and I have to try and like aim the ball. So I'm trying to overcorrect myself when I throw one to his chest and then like maybe I yank one and then I try to overcorrect and then I miss up and away. It's kind of a mess right now, but it'll all come back. I'm not worried about that. Like I said, it's super early in the stages and I gotta stay within the velocity constraints. So I'm not throwing hard, but it is easier for me to throw the ball where I want to when I'm throwing harder and with some intent. And right now I can't really do that. On a positive note though, everything's been feeling good. I can't complain about how my arm feels. And that's basically the biggest thing right now is how my arm has, is feeling. Gonna go make it feel even better in the training room right now, do some post throw stuff. And all the guys are gone. It's about one o'clock right now. All the guys have left to go home. They're probably gonna come back here um, probably in about an hour and a half, two hours or so. They gotta be back here before 3.45, so. So gonna go into the training room, get all that stuff done, hang around maybe, maybe go back home. Not 100% sure yet. 
We'll figure it out, but arm felt good today. All right, y'all, we're chilling out here. What do we got going on? Playing the show. Big stumps fade. Show them that fade, though. Did you ask him to put the line in it? Yeah, of course, bro. Set me up with that hard fade. <laughs> the hard, the hard fade. All right, y'all, game's about to start. You know, score prediction time. I got 6-1 Cox. What do you got? I got 2 1 Cox. Close game. Let's win it. Cheeseburger, cheeseburger. You got it? What do you got? Tonight's school. 6 4. 27 inning. Screamer of a home run by Ethan Petrie. Wins the game for the Cox 1 0. Y'all heard it here. Let's get a dub, baby. Get through.
big comeback win for us. Got a chance to win the series. It's the biggest game of the year, so feel like we got the mojo back. Fans gonna pack it out tonight. Let's get that game three dub and win a series. All right, y'all did not finish the regular season how we had hoped. Um, just just a tough stretch for us, honestly, and over the last month. Got to go down to Hoover in a couple days here for the SEC tournament and uh, hope we can find the mojo back. Y'all saw me before game three um, said that I felt like we got the mojo back. It really did feel like that. And then, um, you know, just didn't go out there and, and take care of business in game three. But just got to go out there. This, this upcoming week and hopefully find the groove back and take care of some business down in Hoover and um, hopefully find the mojo back and get ready for the postseason. Um, I'm not really sure what the hosting picture is looking like right now. It might come down to some games in Hoover that we have to win, but we'll see what happens. Um, but yeah, that's, that's going to be it for this video, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy. If you did, be sure to leave a like down below. Also, if you're new to the channel, be sure you subscribe and click that little bell down below so y'all can get notified every single time I post a new video. Also going to give a shout out to the merch website. If you haven't checked out my website, be sure to head over there. I'll put the link right up here. I've got t-shirts, long sleeves, hoodies, tank tops, hats, water bottles, lots, lots of stuff over there. Help support me, help support the channel. And yeah, guys, uh, next week down in Hoover, SEC tournament, postseason's coming up, super excited. And yeah, guys, I will see you all next week. Peace out.